The main line is home to many wonderful towns, which also makes it really difficult to decide which areas are the best suited for you. So today we're going to talk about Narberth, the pros and cons, and if it is truly the one for you or not. So make sure you stay till the end as I'll be giving my personal opinion too. So welcome to Narberth. PA with a population of just over 5,000 on the historic mainline PA, and this is a great area to call home. Narberth is located in Montgomery County and is on a parcel of land originally deeded to Edward Rees, who arrived from Wales in 1682. And Narberth was originally a Quaker friendly town in 1881, and it offers the Narbrook Park Historic District, which is on the National Register of Historic Places. So it is only half a mile in diameter, so it's small, but it's surrounded by the Lower Marion Township. As such, homes in Narberth are nearly all in walking distance of the town center. And welcome to the cons of Narberth. There are not really often homes for sale as they get snapped up quickly. And there are no super sized stores. You need to go to the town over to do the Target and the Bed Bath Beyond Essentials. But overall, it is an excellent location to Philadelphia because of being on the main line and being in Lower Marion Township. And here are some of the things to consider before moving to Narberth. The business center is mostly independent businesses. And for those who appreciate businesses who have been in the town center for decades, there is the American Family Market, the Cheese Company, and Real Pizza. Also new businesses have opened, including Sweet Mabel Store and Studio, the Narberth Bookshop, Le Petit Mitron, a French bakery. Narberth also has an independent movie theater and has occasional events. So including the spring sidewalk sale and Narberth Dickens Festival. So additionally, Narberth has two recreational facilities, the Narberth Playground and the Sabine Avenue Playground. Seasonally, the town sponsors camps and lessons at each, and the school districts for Narberth are excellent and ranked as some of the best in all of Pennsylvania. So you will see lots of family, families who look in and around Narberth. In addition to those downsizing, because the area is so walkable. Riggy wants to move around here, don't you buddy? We're almost done. So available housing in Narberth. It includes homes and apartments that are walkable to the business center. It is very small. And if you see a home, and if you um, see a home for sale in, in Narberth, you definitely need to act on it quickly. These homes are highly desirable and they are usually going to be like under the 400 range. However, I mean, they can go up from there, but there are condos for sale that come to closer to the 200 and up range, but may be in need of renovation in terms of home prices going up in the past few years. Since the area is so small, they increase accordingly to the age of the apartment of the home. And with the typical increases in the area of the main line, so when we talk about mainline homes and as you visit this channel, you have to keep in mind that the mainline is historic with so, so much history and incredible beauty dating back as long as the founding of the United States. So as such, the real estate is much, much more desirable and it, it's more expensive. So if you're looking for an area with rich history, this can be an opportunity and Narberth has absolute charm on the main line. So I get calls all of the time, people reaching out to me and wanting to move to the main line or around the area. So 
I would love to let you know more about it. My number is in the description below. If you've enjoyed this video, I'm sure you are going to love the next one on the screen right now. So thank you so much for watching. Say thank you, Riggy. Thank you.